Russia's World of Energy. That is a nuclear power plant here in South Carolina. Welcome, my friends. Welcome to another aimless adventure and happy new year to you. I want to start this video off by saying thank you. I appreciate each and every one of you for taking time out of your day to spend time with me on my crazy little adventures. And a huge congratulations to Jay, Tampa Jay, and Chris the Girl on their recent engagement. What a way to welcome in the New Year's. New Year's. I don't even know what I'm saying. I'm that excited. And why am I here? I'm in Greenville, South Carolina for this. Hockey. Oh yeah. This is the ECHL, the East Coast Hockey League. You've got the East Coast Hockey League. You've got the American Hockey League. You've got the NHL and a lot of different farm teams in between. This is the Greenville Swamp Rabbits, which I believe, if I remember correctly, are associated with the Ontario Reign of Ontario, California who are associated with the LA Kings of LA, California. I may be completely off on that. I'm just going off of memory. All these teams, especially the, 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 the lower tier teams and even the AHL sponsor, uh, uh, affiliates, they change often. So hopefully I'm correct. If I'm not, show me a little grace. Game time today is three o'clock. I think it's time we explore more. Of the Greenville Swamp Rabbits. Let's do it. I have never been here before. Just secured my ticket and it's time to head in. Looks like a pretty festive crowd. I think they're giving away jerseys to kids today. Little kids get free jerseys, at least like the first 1,500 of them. All right, I've made it inside. I'm looking for 107. Double D. Sidney Crosby. Oh, it's Mario. Mario is here. And he's apparently hungry. So I'm going to be heading that way. But first, let's check out some of this merch. We got merch up the yin yang here. Lots of everything from pucks to even little swamp rabbits right there. A swamp rabbit. And I don't know if that's a swamp bear. Probably not. And we've got all kind of decals here. Check this out. Yeah, they are affiliated with the Kings. I guessed correctly. My memory has not failed me yet. At least this year, because it's the first day of the year. The LA Kings socks Roscoe Soul Train. That's for you, bro. And this is your uh, ECHL affiliate, too. Pretty, pretty decent selection of caps. Located another merch booth, and this one has got all kinds of stuff. Oh, there's a Dead Wings guy over there, Roscoe. Two of them. Looks like uh, that Sergei Fedorov. There's an Iserman. Can't see past that lady, but your boys are here, Roscoe. Before they were called the Swamp Rabbits, they were the Greenville Growl. And check this out. They've got that OG. Definitely, uh, definitely a better, better logo. I'm, I'm thinking. That's some pretty sweet merch. These jerseys are slick right here. It's a slick, slick jersey. There's your NHL affiliate. POV from row number three behind the net just off to the left circle we're going to see some smashing going on at this level I expect a lot of slap shots 
and uh, maybe some fisticuffs over here in this corner. It looks like a good corner to mix it up. talking about Just like that, Jacksonville ties it up. Pay attention to the low left screen. 22 orange, 15 white come together. 15 white loses a chiclet. That was a rather festive first period. That, uh, that ended with a bang, or at least a bell. I decided to leave my seats down by the glass to get a couple different points of view from around the stadium. Jacksonville's been leaving that high slot open. See if they can get something going. Oh, 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 yeah! Woo! Beat him like a rented mule. Score right now is 2 1 Greenville over Jacksonville. 13 minutes left in the second period. And this barn is pretty loud, man. I am very impressed. Highly recommend seeing a game here. This crowd is into it. Escalated quickly. Got ourselves a tie game here. 
7-19 left in the second. 2-2. While I'm out here trying to track down some chow, apparently Rainbow has scored. This is what I'm dealing with here, though, is this is a brat, a brat with uh, chow chow and uh, comeback sauce and pork cracklings or chicharrones on top. Got some merch, I'll show you that later. And uh, of course water, because I'm not doing the sodas. It's now 4-3, Rainbow. And that's the end of the second period. That bratwurst I got was called a Wicked Weed Dog. I'm pretty sure it has nothing to do with cannabis. There's a brewery called Wicked Weed Brewery, so probably affiliated with that as far as I know. But I guess I'll find out here shortly, won't I? They've got an outdoor lounge, but because it's cold and it's been raining, there's not a whole lot of folks hanging out out there. There's the Wicked Weed Brewing I was talking about. So I'm, I'm not tripping. Upstairs behind the goalie. is a very sweet lounge with a fantastic view. And you're going to see every possible jersey under the sun from everywhere. I've even seen European jerseys here. Rainbow's got a strong hockey community. This is very cool. for the third period puck drop. Here we go. That's what we eventually call the smooth floor. And that'll be a two minute trip to the penalty and power play for green. Dang it, I missed going on that goal, sorry y'all. <laughs> it's now 5-3 Greenville. Jacksonville just scored, it's 5-4 Greenville. A massive swamp rabbit just showed up at the party deck. Do rabbits drink booze? game here in the third. Closing minutes. Are you getting stressed out? Good. Me neither. <laughs>
that interference open ice check turned into a little bit of dancing. Not not by them. Not by these boys. Don't know what the call is going to be. Hopefully, there's matching minors and the refs will let these guys play. We've only got 2.13 left in a tie game. Match them up, give them two each, and let them play. Save. And they did match them up. They, I believe that's going to be matching minors. And they're going to let these boys play because they earned it. <laughs> Heading to overtime tied five apiece. And we're about to see some three-on-three -three open ice action. It's like pond hockey with referees. And Jacksonville is cycling down low big time right now. Are you kidding me? How the heck did he sneak that in short side? That's that's game. Jacksonville defeats the Greenville Swamp Rabbits in OT with the three on three action. Great game. That's a wrap. Jacksonville comes in and wins it. 6-5 in overtime. This place has been ruckus. Excellent place to see a game. If you like hockey and you're ever in Greenville, South Carolina, I highly recommend coming to this barn and getting some of this. Well, that's going to do it from this one from Greenville, South Carolina. The site of the old Greenville Auditorium, I believe, is what used to be here. But now, it's a very sweet hockey arena, and that's awesome. Hat tip to the Greenville Swamp Rabbits for putting on an amazing, not only game, but the staff. Everybody here was awesome. I highly recommend coming here and checking out a game. This is a class act operation. And they have a very good hockey program. They are affiliated with the Ontario Reign in California of the AHL, as well as the Los Angeles Kings of the NHL. All that to say this, I appreciate you. Happy New Year from Greenville, South Carolina. And until next time, <clears throat> I'm a bit hoarse. That does not mean I'm gonna be sleeping outside tonight. Until next time, prepare yourself for 2023 and bad puns from this guy. Till then, adventure on. Two bodies out in the fog. 
wonder if that's the captain and his boys. Perhaps I should turn on the radio and see if Adrian Barbeau has got something to say. And here's the haul from the Swamp Rabbits game. They were giving out jerseys. So um, these are youth, actually. It's like a men's small, uh, men's medium, I'd say. XL youth, I think is what they call it. But it'll probably fit a dude who wears a medium, which is not me. So I'll be giving this thing away. And there's a look at the back. You got Greenville, 23 for you know 2023 which is kind of a cool concept that they did that that's smart marketing and i don't know who h and w electrical is but they're more than likely in greenville and i picked up a hat with this sweet swamp rabbits logo on it um yeah very cool i normally wear the trucker style this is a stretch fit from whatever that company is and uh, there's another Swamp Rabbit over here on that side. Pretty cool logo. Um, minor league hockey has come a long way in marketing, um, but mostly in uh, play. A uh, high level of play, not, uh, not shabby by any means. So I remember when I was in Vegas, we had an ECHL team that came along. We, well, we had an AHL, which was the Las Vegas Thunder. Uh, then they went away, and then we got the Las Vegas Wranglers, which played at the Orleans Arena for a handful of years, and uh, they were ECHL. So ECHL being uh, the bottom tier, AHL, one up, and then NHL. So Swamp Rabbits, you go from the Swamp Rabbits of Greenville, South Carolina, to the Ontario Reign in Ontario, California, and from there to the LA Kings, so. If y'all have uh, minor league hockey in your area, I highly recommend going and support them. It's a fantastic game. If you've never been to a hockey game, go check it out. I think you're going to love the game. It's always been my passion, uh, both, you know, watching, playing, and uh, coaching for a brief time. But after a few concussions, you kind of reevaluate what you want to do with the rest of your life, and that's the way it goes. I appreciate you guys watching.